In the quiet village of Eldoria, nestled between rolling hills and dense forests, there lived a young woman named Leda. Eldoria was a place untouched by the chaos of the outside world, where the villagers lived simple lives and cherished the tranquility that surrounded them. Leda, however, harbored a restless spirit, a curiosity that extended beyond the boundaries of her quaint village. One day, as Leda roamed the outskirts of Eldoria, she stumbled upon an ancient ruin hidden deep within the woods. The ruins were overgrown with ivy and moss, their secrets guarded by the passage of time. Intrigued, Leda ventured further, guided only by the whispers of the wind and the mysterious aura that surrounded the crumbling structure. As she entered the heart of the ruins, Leda discovered a weathered stone pedestal upon which rested a small, intricately crafted box. Its surface bore enigmatic patterns, and its edges were adorned with delicate carvings that seemed to tell a tale of forgotten gods and forbidden knowledge. A shiver ran down Leda's spine as she reached out to touch the box, sensing the weight of history in its ancient presence. The village elders had always warned against meddling with the unknown, for Eldoria had long enjoyed peace and prosperity, shielded by the enchantments that guarded its borders. Yet Leda, driven by an insatiable curiosity, decided to open the box. With trembling hands, she lifted the lid, releasing a burst of otherworldly energy that sent ripples through the air. To Leda's surprise, instead of unleashing chaos, the box revealed a soft, ethereal light that enveloped her. She felt a surge of newfound knowledge flooding her mind, as if the box itself held the key to the universe's deepest mysteries. The villagers, unaware of the disturbance in the woods, continued their peaceful lives, oblivious to the subtle changes that began to take hold of their once idyllic surroundings. As Leda returned to Eldoria, she found herself endowed with a profound understanding of the natural world. She could communicate with animals, control the elements, and heal wounds with a mere touch. The villagers, witnessing her newfound abilities, regarded her with a mix of awe and fear. Leda, however, saw her gifts as a chance to guide and protect her people. Days turned into weeks, and Leda's influence grew. The once simple village began to prosper in ways it never had before. Crops flourished and the air seemed to hum with a harmonious energy. Eldoria had become a haven of abundance and prosperity, and the villagers credited Leda for their newfound blessings. However, as time passed, the effects of Leda's actions became increasingly apparent. The delicate balance of nature started to shift, and whispers of unease spread among the villagers. The animals that once roamed freely began to act erratically, and the once crystal-clear waters turned murky. The elders, sensing a disturbance, confronted Leda, urging her to reconsider the path she had chosen. But Leda, intoxicated by the power she held, dismissed their concerns. She believed she could shape a utopia, a paradise where her people would live in perpetual harmony with the world around them. Unbeknownst to her, the ancient box she had opened harbored not only enlightenment, but also the seeds of destruction. As the village teetered on the brink of imbalance, a darkness began to seep into Eldoria. Strange shadows lurked in the corners, and unsettling whispers echoed through the once peaceful streets. The villagers, once grateful for Leda's gifts, now cast fearful glances in her direction, sensing that something had gone terribly wrong. One night, as a blood-red moon hung low in the sky, the true nature of Pandora's box unfolded. From the depths of the forest emerged otherworldly creatures, manifestations of the imbalances Leda had unknowingly unleashed. They tore through the village, leaving chaos and despair in their wake. Leda, realizing the gravity of her mistake, sought to rectify the situation. She ventured back into the heart of the ruins, determined to find a way to seal the unleashed forces. The ancient carvings on the walls whispered warnings and solutions, guiding her through the labyrinthine passages. 
In the heart of the ruins, Leda discovered a chamber where the box had once rested. The air was thick with an ominous energy, and the walls seemed to pulse with an ancient power. Leda, drawing upon the knowledge she had gained, began a ritual to mend the fractures in the fabric of reality. As she chanted incantations and drew symbols in the air, the box reappeared before her. This time, however, it radiated a dim, flickering light. Leda understood that she had to make a sacrifice to restore balance, to close the box and imprison the unleashed forces once more. In a moment of profound clarity, Leda realized that the true power of Pandora's box lay not in the gifts it offered, but in the responsibility it demanded. With a heavy heart, she made the ultimate sacrifice, offering a part of her own essence to seal the box and undo the havoc she had wrought. The ruins trembled as the ritual reached its climax, and the unleashed forces were drawn back into the box. Eldoria, once again cloaked in the serenity of enchantment, began to heal from the wounds inflicted upon it. The creatures that had terrorized the village dissipated into the shadows, leaving behind only whispers of the calamity that had transpired. Leda emerged from the ruins, weakened but wiser. The villagers, still reeling from the nightmarish events, watched her with a mix of gratitude and apprehension. The elders, their skepticism replaced by a newfound respect, acknowledged the gravity of Leda's sacrifice. Eldoria, though scarred by the ordeal, learned to cherish the delicate balance of nature. Leda, now a humble guardian rather than a misguided savior, dedicated herself to nurturing the village and preserving the harmony that had once defined it. The story of Pandora's box became a cautionary tale, passed down through generations, a reminder that the pursuit of power without wisdom could lead to unintended consequences. Eldoria, having weathered the storm, stood as a testament to the resilience of those who learned from their mistakes and embraced the responsibilities that came with the mysteries of the universe.